Yo, what's good, YouTube? Today, I'm gonna be showing you guys how to get a free diamond, a free amethyst, and a diamond that is super OP for only six thousand mt guys this is insane the content 2k drop that you can get these amazing cards for pretty fast for just playing the game for basically free first off i want to pull up this latrell spree well all right guys so you guys can literally get this card for like four thousand mt this mind blows me man you can get this card that evolves into a diamond for just playing the game for only like four thousand mt let me show you guys why this card is so good this is just the ruby evolution i'm just gonna go through the badges he already already has before i go through the ones he gets when he evolves up even more just so you guys know because i can't go back and look at the sapphire ones he started with you start out with gold steady shooter slippery off ball difficult shots acrobat gold quick draw that is extremely important in this game of my team Clutch Shooter, Space Creator, Slithery Finisher, Consistent Finisher, Contact Finisher, that's a very good badge to have, Showtime, Fast Break Finisher, and then just some silver ones like Catch and Shoot. But let, let's go into and show you guys what actually happens when you evolve them. So now when we bring him from Ruby to Amethyst, we're getting a little bit more lateral quickness. Nothing too huge, right? Some steel on there. I mean, geez, he will have an 82 steel. This is just a, a lot of um, defensive stuff like pogo stick, lightning reflexes, off ball pass, defensive leader, pickpocket, stuff like that. Now this is where it gets crazy. When you evolve him into a diamond card, his mid range goes up to an 87, his three pointer is an 86, and this card's shot release is fast and so easy to green where with an 86 three, I think mine is super low right now and I'm just killing three pointers with them every single game. He is carrying me in all time domination right now. So an 86 three pointer with coach and shoe, that's like a 96. And then speed wise, you're looking at 85 and then speed with ball, you're going with 84. Not bad considering he's a small forward. He is 6'5 though. So you're going to want to run him at shooting guards going to be a lot better is that's where I would run him unless you need to run him at small forward because you already have all your shooting guard spots full. But now let's look over, oh his speed too, yeah we just went over that, what am I saying? His badges, so he has gold catch and shoot now, gold corner specialist, silver ankle breaker, quick first step gold, dead eye gold, green machine gold, and tireless shooter gold. This card is for 4000 MT and just playing the game, holy crap that is a deal, for sure. And some of the things, just like where it says play 20 games and make 23 pointers, score 600 points, that might seem like a lot of stuff, but just play triple threat offline. When you're on your triple threat offline grind, domination grind, just throw him in your lineup and he'll be a diamond in no time. Now let's head over to the other card, this Kevin Garnett. You acquire this evolution card for free by playing one of these challenges, the spotlight challenges, Kevin Garnett. You play the first game and you get this evolution card for free that goes all the way up to an amethyst. Let me show you guys this card stats now. So he's 6'11", can run power forward and center. Let me show you guys the badges he starts with before we get him up to the amethyst. He gets gold quick draw, that's huge for Kevin Garnett. Gold green machine, gold pogo stick, that's really good for centers. Showtime and just a bunch of silver badges literally anything you can think of in bronze too. just tons of badges His stats are just okay. I'll show you guys his stats for when he goes up to an amethyst It is insane. So when he goes up to level four wings a ruby He has what's that speed eight plus nine that is seven sixty seven seventy seven speed That is huge for Kevin Garnett he doesn't get any badge upgrades then, so not really any big upgrade when he goes to Ruby. When he goes to Amethyst, this is where it gets insane. He has a 69 three-pointer, wish you and coach, that's like a 78 you can get him up to, and that's really good considering he's a center that gets gold quick draw. Then you also have his speed goes up to a 79, a 79 speed center. That, and his vertical is super high at 87 and his strength is 86 that was the problem with last year's Kevin Garnett card but this year now he has an 86 speed or strength that is super good this is where it gets crazy now the badges on this card is what's gonna make this card so good man he has gold pick and popper Hall of Fame post spin technician gold drop stepper gold rim protector gold box 
gold defensive leader, Hall of Fame rebound chaser, gold post move lockdown, gold tireless defender, gold trapper, gold worm, silver back down punisher, consistent finisher gold, contact finisher gold, cross key scorer gold, pick and roller gold, dream shake gold, and brick wall gold. Keep in mind that he still has gold quick draw. This card is going to be insane. I cannot wait. He was already one of my fav favorite players, and now that 2K made him good this year, and it is free, all you have to do is play the game with him. Oh my god, I'm going to be grinding. I also saw that there was one of the challenges with them that you have to get a lot of rebounds. What I would do is either go into a domination game or triple threat online game and chuck with a shooting guard and then take over Kevin Garnett, run into the paint and try to grab the board. I think that's the best method for that. And then also, if you guys are grinding out these spotlight challenges, well, like evolutionizing your Latrell Sprewell and Kevin Garnett, you also get a free diamond Chris Webber. That's two diamonds and Amethyst, all for only 6k MT and playing the game a little bit. Th this was a great addition to 2k, man. Evolution cards are my favorite thing they added to the game this year. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you guys like this video, I'm on my grind to 1,000 subscribers. If you guys can please leave a sub, that would help me out a ton. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace.